so you guys know, I've been friends with Jelly for a very long time. I literally love him, but I also know some of his deepest and darkest secrets. I know that Jelly's biggest fear is change. And that's why he stopped growing when he was 12. <laughs> I mean, all jokes aside, Jelly's actually a really good role model. He barely drinks. He's never done any drugs. Well, unless you count human growth hormone. I literally love Jelly. He's such a cool and down-to-earth guy. Like, literally, he is the size of a child. Jelly called me the other day, and he told me that Corona and COVID has actually been really helpful for him. Uh, because now, whenever he takes pictures with kids, uh, he doesn't have to explain why they need to keep a meter and a half distance. You guys, by the way, ever seen Jelly in the gym? Me neither. I'm pretty sure he's under a fitness protection program. <laughs> I heard you guys. You've asked for an insane collaboration with me, Jelly, and Slogan Man. One more time. I don't know, maybe like the final GTA 5 race? And I tried organizing it. I invited everyone over to my office, but unfortunately we had to cancel because we have a very strict no children allowed policy. So I was just watching the video and then I realized at about seven minutes and 30 seconds, Jelly switches over to his Discord. I'm pretty sure that's because he couldn't get in enough YouTubers to make it 10 minutes. Oh my God, Jelly. You just have to call me up, man. I, I know quite a few people. I actually got a really fun story about this. So when me, Jelly and Slow moved in together in New York. We just had a wonderful time together. Unfortunately, we ended up getting kicked out for having an untrained pet with us. Jelly literally kept on pooping on the carpet. Also, recently, I've been crowned as the biggest YouTuber from the Netherlands, and I just want to say thank you so much, Cops. But I've also read your comments, and a lot of you guys are telling me that Jelly is actually the biggest YouTuber in the Netherlands. Guys, Jelly is four foot three. He's not even close to being the biggest. Nothing but respect for the guy. I actually would have loved to live Jelly's life one day. I mean, it's just so fascinating and, and so out of the ordinary. He lives such an interesting life. And it's not because he's a YouTuber. It's because he's so short. His life literally must feel like Attack on Titan. Ah!